Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. We're gonna play as the Keeper again today. We gotta keep on, uh, keep on rolling with the Keeper. We gotta get stuff done with him. And hopefully today is a day where we get stuff done. I'll be completely honest with you, I've been playing Keeper runs, attempting to record them for the past couple days. Uh, and they've just been so freaking poor that I feel humiliated to upload them to YouTube. Uh, so I'm just going to preface this right now by saying that I'm uploading this no matter what the hell happens to us. Uh, so be prepared for a loss, be prepared for a win, be prepared for something, but yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. Okay, there we go. So this is some good luck now. Uh, small rock would have been great there, but I'm exceptionally happy about two bombs as well. I hope everybody here is having just the most phenomenal day that you could ever freaking have in your life. Uh, I know that it's been a kind of a crap start to the day for me, if I'm being completely honest with you. Uh, I had to go to the dentist this morning, uh, and, you know, a lot of people, maybe they, you know, you like the dentist. It's a good way to, okay, this is starting to get ridiculous. Uh, it's a good way to get your teeth cleaned, get yourself feeling uh, healthy, I guess is a word you could say. For me, going to the dentist is basically having an awkward conversation with a stranger that you don't know uh, while they dig around in your mouth with a very sharp metal prod. And that, that doesn't really bode as a good time, in my opinion. Like, sure, there's some fun that could be had in uh, going to the dentist, said nobody ever. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm not a big fan. So I had to go there this morning. And then, you know, they're asking you all kinds of questions like, Oh, uh, when did you graduate high school? And, you know, you kind of have to respond like, Because uh, uh, you can't really, like, say anything because there's a sharp metal prod in your mouth. It's just, it's never really the best time in the world. Wow, Abel, we're really, uh, starting this run off. Great. Okay, basically, uh, we need to look for Swallowed Penny. Uh, and we didn't get it, so that's excellent. Okay, well, this floor was, if I'm gonna be completely honest with you, total bust so far. And I would really appreciate it if we, uh, can get Magic Mush or something from this boss. Or at least some kind of damage up or tears up. From this boss. I don't care what, uh, but HP is not going to cut it in this book. Okay, uh, stay away from me, thank you. Uh, how, why I didn't even see that? We died. Okay, uh, you know, restarting. I didn't even see the cannonball come out, so that was a little bit of, uh, you know, bad time there. I can't even say that I'm all that upset about, uh, not having <laughs> that run work out. A little bit stronger item room to start would be uh, a little bit nicer, but you know, we'll see what happens. This is a good opportunity to place a bomb down, uh, hope for some swallowed penny action. Instead, we get like multiple penny action, uh, which is also like incredibly okay. I'm fine with it. I, uh, I had an apple for breakfast this morning, and okay, Explosivo is pretty good. We just got to be careful. Uh, I had an apple for breakfast this morning. It was a pink lady apple, I believe. And it got me thinking about, like, the right kinds of fruit. Because I'm, I'm not a very picky eater. I'll eat pretty much anything. And you're going to notice that I'm back talking about food again. It's because I'm freaking starving right now. Uh, but I know that I'm going to be just kind of chilling here in a little bit. So I figured I'll... Uh, play some Isaac now. And then as a reward for finishing this episode, I'll get some food. But anyway, uh, I had an apple and I started thinking about like what kind of foods I'm picky about and what kind of foods I'm not all that picky about because I'm pretty picky with apples. Like other foods, not at all, but apples, I'm pretty damn picky. So in my opinion, a good apple, it's got to be like hard as a freaking rock. Don't even give me any mushy crap. Like Golden Delicious is one that is very high on the mushy level. I can't do Golden Delicious. Those are just, like, absolutely horrible. I don't get why anybody could ever like those. And then I also like a little bit Tartar Apple. Uh, not Tartar as in what they found on my teeth this morning, but Tartar as in, like, sour. And, uh, yeah, apples are delicious. But, like, I don't care for Red Delicious, which is kind of ironic because it's, you know, supposed to be delicious. Uh, it's got the red part 
hands down, like, for sure. But the delicious part, I'm not overly sure about. Granny Smith are okay. Uh, I have no problems with Granny Smith apples. You want to give me a Granny Smith, I'm down, like, 9 out of 10 times. Uh, but, like, a good Cortland... Okay, D7 sitting in rocks is uh, not exactly anything we need. But, like, a good Cortland, a good Gala, maybe. Pink Ladies are good. I like Brayburn. For those of you that uh, know apples and are passionate about apples, I like a good Brayburn apple. But then, you know, there's other fruits that I'm also picky about, like watermelon. This is the season for watermelon, man. Summer, uh, you gotta have your melons, cantaloupe, honeydew, watermelon, like I just said. And watermelon, for me, it's the same thing. It's gotta be super crisp. I can't, like, sink my teeth into a grainy watermelon. That's just... It's nasty, man. Don't even talk about that but then uh you know honey doing cantaloupe it can be a little bit mushy i'm fine with that because uh, usually mushy means juicy with those and juicy fruit is like the best gum ever but uh yeah it's it's a good time okay what are we doing on this run right now well we're still trying to keep our deal with the double chances alive How's that going exactly right now? Uh, it's actually pretty okay. Explosivo's putting in the work. Uh, it's a pretty good early item, I'd say. Uh, being able to knock out enemies basically just by landing a shot. And having triple shot is also making it easier here. Best friend. Okay, uh, well that's one free pot we can get rid of. Okay, no swallowed penny, so I don't care anymore. Uh, we'll take wooden nickel. I will pop this pill. One makes you larger, that's pretty bad, uh, but we'll survive. And that, I think we just go fight our boss here. I would love to, uh, you know, I'd love to see a deal with the devil that is a one heart deal that's like a really good item that I can get behind and roll with. But I'm also totally fine with going the uh, angel deal route. And oh, that was some flaming, you know what? Okay, I'd be fine with the angel deal route, hoping for a good uh, angel deal item, and doing that whole train there. Okay, you know what? Blow up that. Get a coin. Beautiful. Uh, maybe Swallowed Penny's sitting in these up here. Okay, range and luck uh, is not the best, but I'll live with it, and we'll go on in the next floor. Right now, this run is, uh, it's alright, I'm gonna say. It's nothing to write home about yet, but it's got, like, some pretty halfway decent qualities. Okay, the deal with the Devil Chance is now basically shot on this floor, too. I figured that the red chest, chances of guppy, nine lives, uh, it was worth at least checking out. But, obviously, that didn't go as planned. We got a couple of bombs out of it. A couple of troll bombs, too, that caused us some damage there. But no problem. Oh, I'm so hungry, man. There's these little, like, tiny chicken fried rice containers that are sitting downstairs right now, and I'm about to go, like, slam some chicken fried rice. Okay. Can't see our map. That's a little bit annoying. We also have a nickel sitting there. Not to be confused with a nipple sitting there. Completely different. We'll take it now. Uh, and he's dead, and we'll take that now. Okay, we're getting pretty sloppy right now. We need to step it up a little bit. Just a tiny bit. Don't need to get crazy here, but I would love to uh, not die on the caves. It'd be kind of humiliating. Okay, die. Thank you. Rooms like this are a godsend. And if we can just get one damage up, rooms like this are going to be uh, basically like one-shot dead kind of rooms. I mean, if we can just get a couple of tiers up, a couple of damage up, we're in the clear for like a while. Triple shot makes it easy to uh, like get damage in. But obviously you need more than triple shot. You know an item that would actually benefit us a whole hell of a lot is uh, Tractor Beam. Being able to fire all of the triple shot shots exactly at one person would be a huge advantage. Okay, this is where we blow up both of these guys. This could actually give us uh, Head of the Keeper. So I think that that was worth it to blow those up. And we will check out our shop. 
uh, and buy, we'll buy Broken Watch. Could be a little bit scary, but I think in the long run it will benefit us more to take that. Okay, got a coin sitting there. If we can get this guy to blow up some mushrooms, uh, that will give us a chance at Magic Mush. Beautiful, and beautiful. Okay, there's our item room. Uh, mainly high damage, high tiers, that's what we're looking for here. And we get the Miter, which is not what we're looking for, but we could get Small Rock. Instead we get a Troll Bomb, that is all kinds of crap. And now we're just looking for our boss, uh, we're moving slow. Explosivo's a good start, but we need a little bit more than Explosivo to get this run really popping. Okay, consumables are doing pretty okay. Once again, nothing to write home about. Deal with the double chances, pretty much slandered on this one. But he's dead. We get old bandage, which is so not good. We've come to a, a you know stale point in this run. And I would like to get out of this stale point as soon as we can. Okay. These guys being slowed is nice, but we're going to need, like, a little bit more damage. There we go. Okay, a rune. A Perthrow rune. That is actually, like, really good for us in the fact that, uh, we're at least guaranteed a second chance at a good item here. Another item that would be pretty good with the Keeper would be Tech X. I mean, Tech X is good with every character in the game, uh, but having the triple shot right away, that's a good amount of damage we're going to pour into people uh, if we get Tech X. So if you want to hook me up, game, this room never fails to uh, cause some damage. And I I'm a little bit afraid, and we died again. We're going to restart for a third time. This uh, episode's gonna be a little bit long, but we need to accomplish something, man. Small rock early, couple of flies. Question mark, Bob's curse. Okay, more bombs, I suppose, is okay. Can you give me a uh, small rock, please? I'm asking politely. Okay, thank you. My wishes have been granted. Early damage up is nice. We'll leave that there, actually. Early damage up knocks out these guys uh, in one hit if we shotgun it. Okay, this is this is where we go buck wild on pots, man. If we can pick up Swallowed Penny early, this run is going to look real nice, but uh, obviously we need to actually pick up Swallowed Penny first. Nothing. Man, it seems like every time you want Swallowed Penny, it's gonna pop up like no not even close to like a time where you want it to but then when you don't need it it's all over bad trip man okay we're doing fine obviously small rock is a good pickup early bob's curse is you know it's not a bad item it's just kind of useless for us right now there we go thank you for the nickel drop not to be confused with Nickelback, completely different. I'm a little bit discouraged by the Keeper right now. I'm not gonna, you know, say much more than that, but... Hell, we have better luck with the loss than we do with the Keeper. Okay, let's fight our boss. If we can get another damage up from the boss, we're gonna be in, like, really good shape for the next couple floors. Even a Tears Up, right here. Tears Up? What is it? Magic 8 Ball. That's actually pretty good, too. I'm, I'm fine with that. I think we pop the Stars card right away here. Uh, save ourselves a key. We'll come in here. Okay. Pop Stars. This is a good opportunity to attempt to get a good item. And you know what? Rotten Baby qualifies as a good item in my book. That's going to be extra damage. Uh, if we pick up Hive Mind or something, Rotten Baby is going to be even better. I think that's a good pickup. I did hear a coin drop. There it is. I would love to finish this floor quickly. And because we still need to do boss rush as the keeper. Uh, and so far this run's looking to have boss rush potential. Yeah, it's still early. Uh, but 
it's better than nothing. I would love some bombs to crack into pots as well. Okay, fly. Fly. Go, go, kill him. There we go. And you too. Okay. Boss time. It's Monstro. We should get a deal with the devil here. Obviously, if we get an HP uh, from the boss, we can take a one heart deal with the devil. Is it advisable? Probably not. Uh, but we'll see anyway. We do have an HP upgrade. Yeah. And here we get contract from below. Sure. I'll take contract from below. And then we'll take our HP upgrade coming out. Cool. We'll go back and grab this coin. Uh, there's no reason for us not to. Grab that coin too. I don't think going to our shop is really worthwhile. I think just getting the hell out of this floor is uh, our best bet. Contract from below is going to give us enough consumables to be fine for the rest of the run. Uh, which is mainly why I picked it up. And this is also... Like, really bad, actually. We do have a coin on the floor. Okay, uh, we're doing fine. This run is probably the best out of the three that we've had so far. But, you know, obviously there's still one bad room, and that's a death. I mean, it's rare that we're ever going into a room with only one HP and then dying. It's usually, like... We're getting Rochambeau in one room. We get hit twice. And that's just... That's poor play, man. There's not much we can do about that. We're getting the coin drops when we need the coin drops. We just gotta play better. And, I, and I'm willing to play better. I mean, obviously, uh, I need to. Luck up. See? Like that right there. That was a bad play. Sure, we got a luck upgrade out of it. And I'm, you know, incredibly thankful for that luck upgrade. Uh, but we should not have taken that pill. We shouldn't take any pills. Okay. Got a coin. Looking for our item room. Might be interested in the shop on this one as well. Just to uh, see if there's anything worthwhile. But item room's most important, and there it is. Okay, that was almost bad. Don't get hit on rooms like this where you can easily avoid guys. Beautiful. Pop in here. Halo of Flies is good. I want some kind of damage here. You know what? I always say Papul Duplex is worth taking. This is another time when I think that's correct. Being able to have a little bit of wider shots, get a better spread on our uh, stuff, I think that is acceptable. Okay. Beautiful. Uh, also got a secret room, which has pills. Uh... Okay, I'm going to take the luck ups and then go. There's no need to not, like, there's no need to take these other ones uh, on the off chance that it is a bad trip or a help down, which would be even worse. Okay, Forsaken is fine as long as we keep him out of the top of the room. Okay, and he's done. Beautiful. Toothpicks is a great pickup. I love that a lot, and sadly, we can't take either of these. So we're just going to leave them be uh, and go on to the next floor. Toothpicks is definitely the uh, saving grace of that floor. I, I love that pickup immensely. Obviously, like, a damage up from this uh, floor, growth hormones, uh, you know, stigmata even, I'll take at this point. Just something simple, uh... Crown of the Martyr is fine. Smiley face rooms are, you know, they're okay. You can really feel the tears up. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm feeling it. Am I feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? I'm freaking feeling it. Okay, can we talk about how dumb the uh, new Caveman Spongebob meme is? And now they're starting the Caveman Patrick meme too, and I'm just like, guys, no. Stop. Memes in general are just like, the worst thing that could ever happen in society. And now they're taking, like, childhood shows that were the saving grace of my life and turning them into memes. Okay, milk is... You know, it's good if we get hit, but obviously we don't want to get hit. So, it's kind of like, uh... 
you know, rewarding us for being bad. And I'm never a big fan of uh, rewarding us for being bad items. Kind of seems like a dumb reasoning. You know, something I would love is penetrative shot. You give me Sagittarius or... Oh, Lord. Okay, there we go. I don't know why this room gave me more trouble than it should have, but we're fine. Uh, tinted rock we can't access, uh, and obviously a couple of bombs we can't access either. One bomb allows us to get a lot of value out of that room. Obviously, the tinted rock can't give us a whole lot uh, because we already got small rock, but still fine. For picking up contract from below, our consumable drops have been real bad, and for having a uh, you know three luck upgrades, our consumables are real bad as well. Okay, there we go. We're finally getting some coins. A bomb here will allow me to backtrack. Two cards instead. Two chariot cards. Okay. You know what? Glad we had this discussion. Uh, we're gonna pick up a shot speed upgrade. And a Krampus fight, I'm totally fine with here. Krampus is acceptable. As long as he drops a lump of coal, uh, I will not be upset. Beautiful. Uh, and you did drop a lump of coal. Get rid of the fire. Probably should hit our shop before we go on to the next floor, but I'm actually just going to book it. Uh, this is looking pretty good right now. I don't want to say too, too much, but it's looking pretty good. We're doing good on time if we want to go to boss rush, but I'm going to want a little bit more from this run uh, before I feel comfortable doing boss rush. Just like one more damage up, man, is all I really need. Okay, those guys are a pain. This room has ended my life numerous times in the past. That was real close. Beautiful, 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 okay. No problem, never a doubt in my mind. Okay, let's find our item room. I figure the less rooms we do, less chance we get hit. So, if I can find the right way early, we're going to be in better shape. Use our range to our advantage. We have a range upgrade, uh, which basically just you know, gives us infinite range in my book. I mean, one range upgrade is really all you need. Okay, we're also super slow, man. Growth Hormones would be a really good item for us. Why are we uh, dropping money every time we get hit? Is that, uh, is that something that I haven't picked up on? Why are we dropping money when we get hit? Game? What kind of item did you give me? Seriously, like, why are we... This is a beautiful thing. Don't get me wrong. Is that... No, seriously. <laughs> what is doing that? I'm not going to be sad, like, I'm incredibly happy about it, but why is it doing it? Okay, well, uh, hopefully we have some, you know, new item that comes out of nowhere that gives us money whenever we get hit. And now we're going to just rock the rest of the run because of this? I'd love that. I'm down. Uh, it took it the money from our existing money. Did it? I'm not sure. I don't want to fight the boss yet. I want to go find our item room and crap. I'm actually really confused. Huh. What is doing? Is it a side product of milk, maybe? I really don't know. Okay, uh, that's fine, though. We'll just let it go. Uh, see if it continues doing that. But I'm, I'm a little bit bamboozled, if I'm going to be completely honest with you. Okay, no item room or shop yet. Doing fine on damage. Okay, super pride. You can drop nine lives, can you not? You totally did. Okay, uh, this run is looking up in life. Obviously getting hit is, uh, you know, bad. But if we don't get hit, if we find some HP, we're going to be in pretty damn good shape. Okay, our item room and shop are both here. And we can uh, absolutely bomb our donation machine if there's something that we really desire in here. Ok, 
Okay. Doing fine. Good and good. Oh, really good. Okay. Come in here. Mom's pad is not good. So we'll put it down. Grab one nickel again. The only reason I picked it up is for uh, the mom transformation. Might as well. We get a lover's card, which is going to give us some flies. Uh, and then we'll crack into our shop. I'd be okay with greed right now. Instead, we get two incredibly good items. Okay. I'm going to attempt to get Sackhead. I've, as good as Recycle is, uh, it's almost like on this kind of run where I know we're not going to get infinite money, there's no point in picking up Recycle in our last shop. Because unless we do Hush, like, we're not going to get any more shops anyway. Yeah, I think that's the right move. Recycle's good, or Restock, whatever it's called. I think it's Restock. Uh, but... I Have I come through this room? That was incredible. Okay, uh, never want to do that again. But, okay, that... Yeah, leaving behind Restock. I don't think we were going to get enough money to take it anyway, so there's no point in fretting about it. Let's actually crack into this. Crack into this. Grab those. Okay. We got our boss here. Obviously, HP is up there on the number one things we possibly want from this boss, but we're going to get a cube of meat. So that's kind of like the exact opposite of what I wanted, but an orbital is totally fine. I'll, I'll accept an orbital. We died. Okay, let's grab our Cuban meat. Okay, where, why, who? <laughs> Curse of the Maze is really confusing me on this one. Okay, grab our uh, Cuban meat and go on to the next floor. We're looking for some kind of HP upgrade on this floor. Uh, basically, pills now I'm totally going to take because if they're bad, then they're bad. That was horrible right there. I always do this. I pick up nine lives and then I start playing like poor. We can't play poor. We gotta stick with our uh, go back to what we know. Stick with what we got. Crack into uh, sacks when we get them. Do we have a penetrative shot? Where did we get penetrative shot from? Or spectral tears is I guess what I mean. I'm very confused. A lot of strange stuff is happening on this run. I like to think that I uh, know a lot about the Binding of Isaac, but this run's proven me wrong. Probably shouldn't use my orbital for uh, damage right now in the situation we're in. Probably gonna do it anyway, but, you know, do as I say, not as I do. Just call me uh, the Berenstein Bears dad. Okay. Item room. No item room. This room will always and forever make me hate myself, okay? Strength card is good. Lover's card is, uh, you know, a couple flies. We'll take strength with us. Strength could technically give us a deal with the devil uh, if we so desired it. And that might be something we're interested in, to be honest with you. Here, Font is more flies. I have a feeling that, uh,. Yeah, our boss is right here. Okay, well that's, like, forever gonna be worth it. Couple flies. Don't wanna fight our boss yet, cause that's mom. We still wanna check out our shop and item room. Boss rush, if we had the strength card, I have a feeling that we could totally do boss rush. I think. Uh, we will pick up store credit as well. Give ourselves some free items there. I wish store credit worked on deals with the devil, but that'd be a little bit overpowered. Crack in here. Judas's shadow. I would love to. I really would. Actually, let's use bombs. I would love to. Marked, we can't. I, I can't. Guillotine, I also can't. Uh, that is, like, horrible. That's even worse. Experimental treatment. I'm gonna take it. It gave us an HP upgrade. It also gave us a hefty tears down. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Two of clubs. Take it. The gauze. Uh, sure, we'll take it. We're gonna keep strength. Tower's not good. 
two strength cards. Okay. Oh. I would have loved to have an item better than experimental treatment, man. Sure, one step closer to spawn. But the fact that I believe it's our only syringe, right? Yeah, it's our only syringe. Man, paperclip is so good. We'll grab that on the way out. Because I'm going to assume our boss is this way. The damage actually looks like it's still pretty okay. But we got a hefty tears down. Which is not good. And the fact that these are the same pill, I'm going to hope it is a tears up. It's lemon party. Okay. No need to uh, take that then. This is not our shop. I would still love it if we can make boss rush. So <laughs> let's, uh, let's find our shop sometime this century, please. Still got six lives. Makes me want to do boss rush even more because on the off chance that, uh, we die, we're just going to come back to life, man. Okay, doing fine. Shop is going to obviously be to the right over here. If it's not, then I'm really bamboozled, and it is right here. Perfect. Obviously, we're looking for something, uh, you know, champion belt, maybe. Chaos. Sure, we'll take the ladder. We'll blow up this guy. Gives us a sack. Sack has a troll bomb, and I suppose we just go. Okay, this this floor scares me a little bit, mainly because we're uh, that experimental treatment pull. It's a little bit, eh. Okay, here's what we do. We don't pop strength uh, yet. We pop it in boss rush. I find it hard to believe we're not gonna beat mom. We just gotta pour in damage. Also utilize our cube of meat uh, when we can. Okay. Took damage. Get a coin. Beautiful. Took damage again. No need to super fret here. Just play good. Okay, that's fine. Uh, that was bad, but it's fine. We're also going to get, like, charges on, uh, Wooden Nickel throughout Boss Rush. D why did I stand right on her? Okay, don't be dumb, Ty. You've gotta be kidding me. How stupid am I? Just chill. Get in damage, okay. Take it easy. We're going to be fine here. Okay, we're doing fine. Sorry for being quiet. Just trying to focus a little bit. Just trying to focus. We're doing fine. Just watch out for mom's uh, stupid foot coming down. Okay. Almost done. Almost done. Beautiful. Uh, never down my mind. We take the Polaroid and go into boss rush before it closes. You've got to be kidding me. I would love to pick that up. Uh, please be something good down here. Oh, lord. Okay. Um, well. Here's what we do. Pop this. Grab that. And now we just hope we get a coin sometime soon. Picking up a second, uh... Syringe is, I think, like, totally worth our time here. Okay, and there we go. We get a coin. Okay, focus on adversary. Focus on adversary. It's gonna come spiraling down on top of us. Knock him out. Please just knock him out.
Okay, that's fine. Whew. Next floor. The second syringe is still, like, good. Kind of pissed that we didn't get boss rushed on there. Uh, but it's, it's a process, man. I hate this room with every inch of my body. Good. Okay. Obviously, HP would be excellent. Okay. I still wanted to do this room because I wanted to check out in here. And in stuff, of course, it's absolutely nothing. Beautiful. Love it. Okay. Knockout. Fistula. And that'll get rid of the red guys. Okay. Good, good, good. Some Emperor cards would be a nice game if you want to pop those out of a sack. This is one of the easier rooms on the womb. Okay. We're going to be fine here. Just got to take care of this guy. This piece of crap, if you get what I'm saying. Okay. Beautiful, that is not worth picking up. Of course this isn't our boss. This is a good time for an insanely amazing deal. Never mind, because now we don't have a life. Okay, classic loss, let's go. It's not looking good. How in the frick did Chubb get behind there? You've got to be kidding me. Just die, dude. Please. Thank you. I know you dislike smoke, but dislike it a little bit more. Okay. On a scale of 1 to confident, I'm a 4. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, and go screw yourself. I'll see you next time. Adios.